What's up everyone, Mitchell Saltzman, Rebecca Valentine. We're right here at the AEW Fight Forever booth here at Gamescom 2022 to really talk about uh, uh, AEW Fight Forever, a game that we both kind of played yesterday. So Reb, I know that you've recently gotten into AEW, but you've never really been a wrestling game fan. What, what was it like playing this game for the first time? It was definitely a little bit challenging. Uh, I've not, never played a wrestling game before, and you know, it, it takes some time to sort of get into the controls and understand exactly how to execute the thing that you are wanting to do. And it's, it's a little hard to get that in a demo when you want a little more time with it. But you know, I, I, I picked it up, uh, and it was it was fun. It was it was fun to sort of be able to embody some of the things that I get to see in the ring on a regular basis. I am a huge wrestling fan ever since I was a child, a huge wrestling game fan. And AEW Fight Forever, I think we should be clear about what it is and what it isn't trying to be. This is a game that really goes back to the N64 era. It's really trying to be a no mercy on more modern consoles. So it's not, it's not trying to be a new WWE 2K game. It's not trying to be simulation wrestling. It's trying to be fun arcade action. And you know, I think I think both for better and for worse, it's succeeding at that. Um, it's it's a little bit rough. Uh, there are definitely moments where like the hit detection is off. You'll do it like a, a combo. The first hit will land. The second, third hits won't, and you'll be in a position where now now you're gonna take you know a reversal. Um, so there's definitely some issues uh, to work out. But I think you know if, if you're looking for that N64 era kind of golden age of wrestling experience. This might have it for you. Yeah, there was a moment in I think one of the first matches in your demo where you were able, you were you were like on the ropes, like you were almost done, you were down, and you somehow turned that around into a win. It was so cool. I, so for, we don't have footage of this, and I'm so <laughs> sad about it. But I, I was getting worked the whole match, and then I'm Kenny Omega. Adam Cole has me down for the boom. I dodge, I dodge the knee get my super for immediately from that, hit him with the one-winged angel, and no one kicks out of the one-winged angel. So, like, that moment there was, like, e exactly what I wanted from a wrestling game. And, yeah. you know, I, it was a ton of fun. That, that moment was a ton of fun for sure. Yeah, I was yelling. That, that felt like wrestling to me, and if Fight Forever can have moments like that that have me feel like I am watching or there or present in that moment, then that's probably what I want out of a game like that, even if, you know, every single movement isn't exactly where I need it to be. As long as I'm feeling it, that's that's what matters. Yeah, exactly. So that is AEW Fight Forever. For more Gamescom 2022, keep it here at IGN.